if you are using paysapp application and if you want to transfer money to any application any upi application or any bank account then how can you do that i am going to explain each and everything before that if you are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe let's start the video so first of all you need to open paysapp application and complete the login process now once the application is completely started this is the kind of basic interface you will be able to see on your mobile screen now there are a few uh, transaction related option you can uh, scan any qr and do the payment if you want to pay to any particular upi application you can choose this particular option and you can uh, select the contact number to whom you want to do the payment now next thing is if you want to pay to any bank account you can select two account option over here and then you can uh, simply select the bank account to which you want to transfer the amount you can enter the bank details and you can do the transaction if you want to do self transfer that uh, if you want to transfer from your one bank account to another you can choose self transfer option so this was one way of going into send money option next is if you directly want to do bank transaction you can select bank transfer over here and in two account as i told you you can select the bank account to which you want to do the payment so in my case I'm going to search the bank. So let's search for Indusin Bank over here. And this is the bank. After selecting the bank, all you have to do is you have to enter the account number of the person to whom you want to transfer the money. So enter the account number two times. After that, enter the bank IFSC code of that particular account. Then enter the beneficiary name and select proceed to pay option. So I'm going to fill up all the details very quickly and I'll show you. So after entering the details, all you have to do is you have to select proceed to pay option. And on the next page, uh, you can uh, basically check out the account of that person and you have to enter the amount. In my case, uh, I'm going to enter 500 for now. And if you want to know the maximum limit, if I try to enter two lakhs over here, you can see it will show you a message that enter an amount less than or equal to one lakh. So either you can transfer one lakh or below that. Not uh, possible if you want to transfer an amount uh, above one lakh, that is not possible. So let's enter 500 for now. And then if you have added multiple bank account in PayZap application, then you can choose uh, that from which bank account you want to do the payment. In my case, I'm going to do the payment from Kotak Bank only. So I have selected Kotak Bank, but you can select this drop down and select other bank if you want. After cross verifying each and everything, just select pay option over here. And on the next page, you have to enter six digit UPI pin and then select this tick mark option to complete the transaction. So I have entered the UPI pin. Let's select this tick mark option over here. Now you can see the payment is in process and within few seconds or few minutes, the payment will be done. Now you can see the payment is successful. And in order to check the transaction details, you can select this view more details option over here. Then you can check out the account number to whom you have paid the amount. You can check out the transaction ID. You can check out your UPI ID from which the payment was done. And you can also check few other details over here. So these are the simple steps you need to follow in order to do bank transfer from PayZap application. If you find this video informative, don't forget to subscribe. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.